A teenager was facing 10 years in prison, another man sentenced to death until a Nigerian court set aside their blasphemy convictions on Thursday in cases that caused international outcry. Omar Farouk was accused of making blasphemous comments during an argument, while Yahya Aminu Sharif was accused of having shared a blasphemous message on WhatsApp. Judges at the secular branch of the state's high court ruled that Farouk should be acquitted because he was a minor who had not had adequate legal representation. They said he was 17 years old at the time of sentencing and not 13 as previously stated. Sharif's conviction was quashed and the case was sent back to the Sharia court. A lawyer defending the pair said their lives would never be the same. The case caused international outcry with 120 volunteers, including the head of Poland's Auschwitz Memorial, offering to each serve a month of Farouk's sentence. Nigeria is roughly split between a predominantly Muslim north and a mainly Christian south. The convictions have sparked a debate about Sharia Islamic religious law, with the defendant's lawyers arguing it is incompatible with Nigeria's secular constitution.